let's make Meknas place in Blender with geometry nodes. If you haven't seen part 1 yet, check the iCard above for that. For Meknas place, we need some ground. So I added a grid for now and make it 10 meter by 10 meter and 300 vertices on both the axes. Add a set position node and a position field and vector math. Plug them into set position. Add a noise texture and combine XYZ to get the ground displaced on a Z axis. Now add a math node set to multiply and a color ramp. That's how we make the spikes. Increase the vertices on grid. Add join geometry node and spikes to join geometry node and bring a transform node. Plug spikes into the transform node and then into the join geometry node. Make this one bigger and place it near with some changes. Duplicate the transform node and plug spike again. Translate and rotate it and place it in the right. Now add anything and in geometry node replace it with the grid and add a transform node. Duplicate the ground setup from our spikes add them into here plug that into transform we need ground not spike here so make the noise texture small and play with math node for less spikes ground place it on some level as spike ground with math node set value to a lower number now add a set shade smooth node as you can see i added mix rgb node and in bottom socket i added a wave texture with color wrap and math node to give more variation to the ground and then added gradient and noise texture to get the details added another gradient node with mix rgb to give the ground some difference to separate the top and bottom area in front of the camera tweaking the setting as you like to make it as good as possible then i duplicated the ground and hide that this is for backup if i messed up with the ground always take a backup if you need to apply the geometry node modifier and start making the ground more wavy with proportional editing i try to match as close as possible to the reference after i happy with all the tweaks i started making some vines look to ground this model i downloaded to make vecna's house link in the description now add a cylinder which is going to be the closest spike to the camera then i use proportional editing with random fallout to get more spiky look i added some bezier curve to make the vines and added them so they look like surrounding the spikes duplicate the spike place couple of them with different size to make variation flatten the ground for adding a house import it to the house place it this is fbx so we need to make textures i darken the texture little more to get the old abandoned house feel fix some areas duplicate the house for backup use self fracture to break the house into pieces add them into collection and now place them floating in upside down deleted extra duplicates now i am fast forwarding this so you can slow down if you need to After I placed all broken pieces, I added a cube with volume for some fog and for the ground texture, simply dark so with noise texture, plug into the base color and mask grave into the roughness. Switch to render view for better seeing what's going on. Added a cube for clouds placed behind the house. Replace principal wheels here with the volume scatter node. Plug that into the volume. Hit Ctrl T. Replace image texture with noise texture. Change coordinate from UV to object. Add color ramp to control the cloud sensitivity. Added some point light with red color to make the thunder and light the scene. I changed point light to area light. Adjusted, adjusted the ground form. Scaled the light to narrow down their covering area and more like lights coming from the thunder in the clouds.
gradient and mix RGB I got this look of clouds now texture the vines with noise texture and color ramp bump note for some bump set material in geometry node the fog near the ground look less interesting for making that interesting add a noise texture and a color ramp add an area light to light our character and foreground the debris looking too close so i spread them across the sky duplicated some bits and also duplicated the camera extend the ground as i am happy with my scene i bring the footage of the character as image explained you can activate it in edit preferences add-on she is not moving in the shot so i just animated the camera going up and also i parented the footage to the camera so she is not out of frame i added more lights to light the character and after some tweaking i get this now it's all up to you however you want you like you can adjust the scene after everything done try fail retry but don't quit that's what make a good artist bye bye see you in the next video